Hey, yesterday I made a cryptocurrency video and um, I took it down. I took it down in less than one hour. Um, it's still unlisted, it's still viewable with people that have the link, but I decided to take it down, even though there's no dislike, uh, feedback was kind of positive. Um, I realized that it might not be the right time to introduce cryptocurrencies and people go crazy on money and I don't want to drive them to do bad investment or to get into the cryptocurrency space without knowing much what they're getting into, uh, especially young people. We have, a, we have, according to analytics, we have a lot of young people. So I want to make sure that doesn't happen. I decided to take off um, the cryptocurrency videos. That being said, this is not done forever. I still want to introduce cryptocurrency, but we'll do it in a uh, dev manner. So we're going to program stuff on the blockchain or we're going to create a smart contract on Ethereum. I don't want people to invest money at places they can lose. I just don't feel like taking the blame for that. I don't want to be accountable, but there is money to be made uh, if you're smart. And if you trade well, if you take low risk, there is some high rewards out there. I just don't want to be the one that tells you what to do. Right. That being said, um, I've also introduced something else in yesterday's video that is now taken off. Um, I've introduced a Udemy course, something I've been working on on the last three weeks, which is also why we've been not that active on the channel. We've been doing some challenge, we've been doing some random videos, um, but not so much on, on Udemy. Now, my course is currently on Udemy. You can buy it if you want, that'd be great. I'd actually love it quite a lot if you did. Um, it is about making a top-down RPG game. You can get the course for only $10, so that would help me quite a lot if you decided to take the course. Now, that being said, we don't want to make every content something payable, but we are trying to make a little bit of money so, so eventually we can kickstart something bigger. Um, and that would help us in our future goals. I will play the promotion clip that's on Udemy, which I have not saved, so I'll play it directly on my computer. Okay, let's go. Do you want to learn how to create a top-down game, and that in a very short amount of time? This course will guide you through the steps and challenges of doing so. My name is Michael Doyon. I'm a self-taught game developer, ex-Ubisoft employee and former professional gamer. I started teaching two years ago in college and now I'm an online tutor with over 400 educational video on the web. Those can be found on my YouTube channel if you'd like to have a preview on how I teach before purchasing this course. In here, you will be using the latest and most popular tool available for creating games. One of them is the Notorious Unity Engine. We will be running the latest version, currently 2017.2, and learn all about the animator and the keyframe animation, the sprite animations, the new tile map system, manual collision detection, the UI system and creating animated menus, layers, and much more. We will also create different gameplay systems like a combat system, a character selection, weapon upgrade, experience system with leveling up, and a floating text system. This project is made out of 21 C Sharp script, which totals under a thousand lines of code. We leverage Unity's capability everywhere we can to save us as much technical work as we can. I believe this is a good approach because we will be forced to look at all the little things the engine gives us to speed up our workflow. I will be sharing with you my tips and introduce you to the way I work along the way. I hope you join me on this project and I will see you on the other side. If you made it to the end of this video, first, thank you, and second, if you plan on buying the course, we do have a, a coupon code out there. So it's going to be first link in the description down below is going to have your coupon code inside of it. And it's going to be for only 10 bucks. Now, um, I'm also going to do something else. I'm also going to ask something out of you. If you could please, once you're done taking the course, um, when you're ready, drop a honest review on the course, as this is going to help me a lot get back in the algorithm. I've been, um, I've been on Udemy for what about? four days, four or five days, and I didn't have a lot of reviews on the course, I have about four reviews, and eventually this one guy came and he left me a 0.5, which by default is, um, is actually putting me back in the algorithm somewhere where I don't make any more sales simply because they just don't show up. 
The course was too low rated because I only had four ratings and this one came in with a 0 0.5 which is just destroying all my chance to do any profit on this thing. And I usually wouldn't ask this, like that's fair if he gave me an honest thing and this comment looks like it's honest but this person is actually just a troll and he's running under two names, Adam, Jason, and his QR code means um, you're an idiot, that's what it says in the background. Anyway. Uh, I'd like to actually get back on, on the algorithm. I know it's, it's a little bit weird of me to ask. I don't like asking this kind of stuff and nobody likes asking this kind of stuff, but it's messing a lot with the sales and it's just something that I'm so hopeless against. And uh, yeah, it kind of sucks. And it kind of sucks to beg you for reviews as well. Mm, that being said, we are going to go back to making U Unity content uh, this week. Yeah. All right, see you there.